guys, this is Fire Alarm Tech 500, and this is going to be all the devices in my Fire Alarm collection. And also, I'm going to pull every device in my collection. This is a Fireway BG6. And this is my Fireway BG10. And this is a Firelight BG12 LX. Um, it's got a very, very, a very big model number inside of it. And this is my Firelight model 6SS 24 volt AC Bell. This is one of the series I have. It's a Notifier BG1. It doesn't really pull, but I'll open it up. And this is my Notifier BNG1, one of the series I have. Again, it doesn't really pull, but I'll open it up just to show you the inside. And then next we got a Notifier LNG1R push in. I guess it was already pulled. Then I've got a Notifier NWS. Which was back then harshly owned by M Part, I believe. Yeah, it was harshly owned by M Part. Then we got a notifier Cody Pool. And this is my um, Ninja Controls Pool Station. I don't know the model number of this. It's basically just the front cover of it. And here I've got a System Sensor Mini Strobe. And a system sensor mini strobe in white that will go on top of the PA400 horn in white or red. Here's my system sensor 2412 24TH detector. A 2400 series detector head. And then I got a Pyrotronics uh, electronic horn strobe. It's a very rare rebranded wheel lock electronic horn strobe. So here I have a wheel lock, a very rare strobe, a very rare strobe. It's a wheel lock w, uh, WW strobe. I'm having a rebrand of this coming up soon. It's the Cybers Pyrotronics one. Then we've got a Cybers Pyrotronics Intuitual Pull Station. That should only be activated with the key. You saw this in system test too. Here I got a wheel lock MIZ. Then we have a Gentex SHG, Gentex SHG horn, Gentex GXS. Then we got a system sensor Spectre or Classic P275. This is my system sensor advance P2W. And this is my System Sensor Advanced SR SWSP. And this is a low volume sounder strobe P2W HW LF. And then this is my Wheel Lock Exceeder LED. It's a strobe only. Wheel Lock ZNS 24 volt. Wheel Lock MT 24 volt. Then I've got an EST Genesis. I'm not going to get into the model number, but it's a strobe only. Here, my, here I have my EST Genesis uh, LED, which is a straight knockoff of the Wheel Lock one. Um, you might see the size of comparison. This is a strobe only two, but um, I'll make a video on those twos. I'll make a video on those two guys over there. Oh, I'll actually make a video of those two fire alarms right there. Here I have an EST Genesis uh, speaker strobe. Uh, it is missing the speaker, so it's just a strobe. Then I've got an Exide, Exide English, Exide um, 24 volt light. Then next in line is my Simplex Chevron. The little, the little sticker fell off. So it's already pulled, fail. And then I've got my Simplex BG50, which has a bigger model number in it, 2099, something like that. 
It has a glass brake rod. Yep, BG50. It's pretty cool that you pull up. Pretty cool. The next is my Faraday F1 GGT. That's already pulled. Then I have an Edwards Ching. That's a bell. I've got my Edwards uh, 7889R. Well, New Age Server Alarm also has one of these, but his is the wall mount version. I only have a sitting mount version, so um, they're one of these on eBay, so they're pretty cool. And then I've got a Edwards adapter horn. It's actually a 2009 adapter horn. I like how it says fire horn on it. Pretty cool, huh? And it's a very loud device. Then I've got my EST779 bell. 26 volt bell. We lock 7002. And then coming down here is my frog in the way. Here I got an Amsico horn strobe and my Amsico horn, which I decided to put the strobe on it, but uh, I didn't really want to put it on there. And then coming down here is my um, ADT MS5. And I got this, uh, wait, not that one yet. We're gonna start right here. Here's my Torque Alert MT. This is not an MT, it's an EHEL17W. Horn strobe. Then here I've got a Signal Communications Corporation strobe. Pretty rare device. And I got this brand new today. It's my Torque Alert um, PPS. Um, it's a straight knockoff of the BG8 pull station. Let me pull that down. Yeah, it looks a lot like a BG8. Coming down here, it's my. Uh, Simplex uh, 452107, which this looks like a coated pull, but it isn't. And then I've got an Alertec uh, modeled MS5678990 455680A strobe plate. And here I've got a Sound Doiler. Uh, Rear strobe, it's a silver version. And then last of all, it's my uh Whelan is the company that makes um strobes for dyno master vehicles, like a highway strobe or something. It's pretty cool, it's a very rare fire alarm strobe. So uh thank you for watching. That is all for my fire alarm collection. I gotta go reset those pulls and put this all away. So thank you for watching.